Hey, stupid! You can't be on here without a hat! Yeah, thanks a lot. Site inspection! Architect on site! Those idiots drilled the new caissons on the west side. You're kidding me. The bedrock ends there. We need caissons on the east side. Ah, uh, no drama. It's a government contract. We'll be paid until completion. I ain't taking a fall for this screw-up. It's a government contract. No one's taking a fall. Except the government. And as soon as they are elected, they say, wow, this guy's an asshole. With me, you know from the beginning, I want to be your asshole. I used to be a stuntman and TV actor. I cannot understand policy at all. I need to reduce things to a really basic level. I'm perfect for higher office. Listen, the state of San Andreas is in big trouble. We've cared about people for far too long. I'm not extending a helping hand. I'm giving you all the finger. I will throttle the deficit just like I used to throttle bad guys. Vote for me, Jock Cranley. This message paid for by Jock Cranley for governor. The issues you care about with commercials you don't. WCTR. Weasel News. Laszlo claims he was molested into cutting his hair. Athletes are supporting Carl Wilkins, saying they use performance-enhancing drugs, too. Talent show host Laszlo spoke yesterday about the events that caused him to change his appearance. I wouldn't do this to myself. There are dark forces out there, okay? Colts, I mean, Vinewood isn't all it's cracked up to me. <laughs> Seriously. And now, if you excuse me, I, I gotta go to therapy. Penis Pill News. Over 20 professional baseball, football, basketball, and one soccer player have stepped forward in solidarity with disgraced athlete Carl Wilkins, who has admitted to using performance-enhancing drugs before sex. They say someday all men will need that pill. God bless pharmaceuticals. Weasel News. Confirming your prejudices. WCTR cares about you, your community, and your time spent listening. There's a war going on for your mind, and you've lost it. You've lost it. Oh. This is Chakra Attack. We attack you, and we are ready to attack all the negative things in your life, like a car battery, leave you with only the positive. We remove the negative, so you are fully charged. Hey, you got him? Of course I do, homie. Here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that? Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. All right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. Oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some firebombs. They go bang, the emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by, uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. 
either bombing our office ran by a division of corrupt government psychos or defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah, any, many, money, mo. If you favor the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access to the roof here. Now you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. Now Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, what's it gonna be? <laughs> so you do want to mop. Okay, well, you'll need a couple of gunmen. They'll go in with you as firemen. Everything goes to plan. They won't fire a single bullet, but you will be run. He's my go-to guy. I ain't changing that now. Well, should be okay. He's got a few scores left in him. This is a protected federal building. Are you absolutely sure this is how you want to take it? And we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Uh, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Okay.